Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we are playing not for broadcast. Good evening, I'm Maggie Moore. And I'm Jeremy Dawes. Our main headlines tonight. Stop him, stop him! Uh, okay. Are, are you are you not gonna introduce yourself? I well you know, you normally you lead me in. And now I'm just giving you space to do it yourself. Yeah, at, yeah. At first you were a guest, now you're a co-host. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just going with Earth, the TV show, because... Yeah. <laughs> so, um... Resident knows what this game is, I do not. I, I vaguely know what it is. Uh, and we're, we're, this, this was the safer of the options that I was given. <laughs> the safer? Well, well yeah, because, <laughs> you know, I was given a bunch of options of games we could play, and, uh, you know, this, this was the option that seemed like it would cause the least problems and be the most successful. Plus, uh... You know, when when the game is too funny on its own, it makes it hard to do jokes, you know? Yeah. Cue me trying to turn the fucking TV off. I mean, that would have been cool, but... I guess let's get into it. Yeah. Well, that's a very blunt question. Oh. Alright. <laughs> She's gonna go with it, yeah. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna bother naming it again. That's all coming up on tonight's National Nightly News. I think this is... Also, this is kind of funny for me. Shadow government. Yeah. Shadow we wizard money game. game. We, love. we love casting spells. Yeah. Turn right. Um. Okay. Oh. Oh. Interesting. Shh. Hi, David. I have a call for you. I'm just putting it through. All right, mate. Dave here. Listen. Now, uh, I know you've only come in to clean up the place, but I've got a bit caught up, so uh, you're gonna have to run the news tonight. Now, don't worry. It's not hard, and I'm going to stay on the phone and help you. First, I'm going to give you a quick tour of the broadcast room, so if you're not doing it already, look forwards towards all those screens. Right, look up at the top. That coloured bar is your audience. You want to keep the viewers going up and not down. Underneath <laughs> that, you've got the screens. The one on the right is the broadcast screen. That's what the viewers are seeing at home. It's only a couple of seconds behind the master screen there in the middle. That's the one you control. Now the four small screens on the left show the different signals coming from the studio. And you can choose between them using the numbered buttons on the vision mixer at the bottom left. My microphone's in the way. I'll talk you through it and you'll pick it up in no time. Now, <laughs> there we go. Have a look to your left. That's your right. These plugs control everything in the studio. I've left them set up no for you, so provided you haven't fiddled with them, all you have to do now is throw the master trip switch and we're in business. Once you've got the power on, face the front again. I don't know why you'd need a fan, but... Oh, uh, because, because that's some form of power box. I... I guess. Mate, you've turned the trip switch back off. There's no power. <coughs> Bro is just fucking with things just to fuck with them. Absolutely. You can see on the broadcast screen that we're in the end titles for the show before us. Fortunately, they go on for fucking ages, so there's plenty of time for me to explain. Oh, right, okay, they're over, so we haven't got long now till the broadcast. Right, Where's the jingle? Down under the desk. That was the jingle, fuck. You can see a load of videotapes on the left. They're your 
adverts. Pick any three and load them into the machines on the right. When you've done that, look up to the front again. <laughs> Mouth watering. Healthy housewives. Okay, I bet. Healthy housewives. Every day. Ten seconds, everybody. It's how I show love. You're trying to kill me. And yet you persist. Going in five, four. It's time to join Jeremy Dawson. Good evening. I'm Jeremy Dawson. Our main stories tonight. Okay, we're all good. Next is going to be to throw the news titles on screen too. There'll be a countdown, but I'll we'll count you in as well. Just relax, mate. It's all gravy. Buys honest Andy's totally independent huh. and corners the flawed market. Top chat. Sports fans everywhere celebrate as popular footballer Johnny Hansleaves wins Sports Personality of the Year. And a spoon Interesting. Megan will be chatting with movie star Lawrence Yippee. Thunderclap. More audience. Movie, the medicated. And, of course, we'll be going live to advanced headquarters to hear what the Nine, leaders of this fledgling eight, party have to seven. say on their historic... Right. Two, three, oh! Two, one, lovely mate. Next thing is to throw back to Jeremy with button one when that globe in the middle shrinks down and vanishes. <laughs> and you are really bad at listening to directions, aren't you? You should not have given me this power. Mm -hmm. Fuck the Jedi, I got this. Switch to screen one. Lovely night. But first, the vote is really early, but decisive win for advance. The landslide victory. With an astonishing 81% of the popular vote, is the biggest election win. Yes, you have the big censor button. <laughs> I did a lot of that last time. <laughs> Not my fault. Yeah, to be fair, I was the one that was saying the things that needed to be censored. However, former Home Secretary. It's going well. All you've got to do now is play the advert at the end of the segment. Make sure you don't play it too early or we'll all get fired. Now the clock at the top is counting you down to the advert. When it reaches zero, press one of the three play ad buttons over there at the bottom right. I mean, already played the first one. They were glowing. And so on, but you can play them in any order you want. I'll count you into it as well, but keep your eye on the clock. And three, two, one, advert. One minute back, everybody. Jeremy, I need you to fill up the ads. What? Why? Wanker Snatch is running late. This is well, not a movie. I thought you'd ask him about the election. Personally, I wouldn't try to confuse him with any big words. Hmm, that's the same policy we use with you. I oh, that man looks, looks very mentally stable. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Wicked. We made it to the first ad break. He's doing great, mate. But this is where it starts getting a bit trickier. This next sequence is what we call a multicam sequence because you're going to be cutting between multiple cameras to keep things interesting. A lot of it's down to personal taste, but here's three good rules of thumb. One, try and keep the shot on whoever is doing the talking. Two, don't stay on the same shot for too long, ten seconds at the most. So if you're on the person who's talking, try and throw in the odd reaction shot or pull out to the wide shot for a bit just to keep it interesting. Three, don't stay on reaction shots for too long. A couple of seconds is usually enough. Then the audience want to see who's doing the talking, yeah? Stick to these rules and you'll be fine. It's not as complicated as it sounds. You've seen programs on television, haven't you? Make it look like those. Might as well get screen one selected now. No need to wait for the broadcast to start. Try and stay ahead, mate. We're coming back from the break. Quiet in the studio. Thank oh, you, you can just so much. Press the button. Ten seconds, everybody. You know, you're playing the game, but uh <laughs> you can there you go. Fuck your countdown. Welcome back to the National Nightly News. Later we'll be hearing from shock election winners advance. But first Get ready to go to Megan on screen four. Is here with a star of both stage and screen. Megan? 
Thank you, Jeremy. Megan Wolf, culture correspondent. And today I have a guest who starred in everything from Shakespeare. Right, to going to Blundercatch on screen three when she says his name. By none other than Lawrence Blundercatch. Thank you so much for coming on. Oh my dear, I do. That was fucking perfect. Yeah. Switch to two for the wide now. <laughs> May I say, having you here with us is among ours. <laughs> right now, just try and stay on whoever's talking. Movie, which is called The Medicated. The Medicated, yes. <laughs> wow, what was that like? Yeah. Well, as I said to Peter at the rack, that's Peter Jensen, the director. Give us a look at Megan's reaction. Lovely. Now back to Thunder Twat. Thunder Twat! Oh my god. It's really, uh. Fantastic to have to such a interesting person. Absolutely right. A scientist. Was that a challenge at all? What exactly are you implying? But seriously, yes, you're right. It was a complete departure from my last starring huh. role when I played Sergeant Brock Rockman in Bullet Man. Brock Rockman in Bullet Man. <laughs> <laughs> Man, if only getting audience was this easy. Been on that show a bit long. I think it's grossed over a billion dollars, but uh, obviously who's counting? <laughs> it's a role that saw you scoop two best actors. <laughs> Just spamming between the three screens. <laughs> so sweet to mention it, but I really <laughs> the, the audience did not like that. <laughs> Those three little statues do take pride of place on my mantelpiece. Uh, with all the others, I'm sure. So, if you're not doing it for rewards, mm. what is it then that drives you? Oh, that is a beautiful question. Beautiful Megan. question. And not easy to answer. Not easy in that. Like you, I'm afraid. Cut me. You should be. And I will. Remember the ten-second rule. That's how it feels, doesn't it? Why, John? Doesn't it? Bleeding. Doesn't it? Giving. Oh, there's little lights on them that tells it. <laughs> Just randomly sends or something. I do it for the difference you make. I do it for the people that I inspire. I do it for the people. The little people. But most of all, I think I do it for the positive that I can bring about in the world. And today, of course, <laughs> we're in for some real change. It looks like in the coming few months. What do you make of this historic election result? Well, <laughs> well, now you're asking. Well, historic election results. Historic election historic results. Uh, I hope not. Very difficult. But, um, <laughs> no comment. <laughs> no fucking comment. One should always strive to eat more ass. Oh, well, don't worry, you won't do it again. She did it again. Okay, don't panic. I'll explain how to deal with swearing at the brain. Medicated, which opens next week. Right, I've swapped the shot of Jeremy on screen one for a VT movie clip. You'll get a countdown on the screen, but I'll just let Megan cue you in. My character, Dr. Lance Hemlock, is faced with a decision that could affect humanity's very survival. Exciting stuff. Let's do exciting Understand it. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, this just game! At random people. You think I don't know that? Yeah, he's just being a massive. C oh my god. Speaking of censorship. <laughs> Bro, fuck this drama. I'm into that right there. Yeah. Well, we got someone new on the field or on the thing. So. Bro, just fucking tosses her across the room. Ah, uh, yeah, that, uh... What the fuck? Dr. Hemlock. <laughs> what is happening? But I didn't listen. Doctor. I'm drowning, Lance, you said. You need to see this. No, it's all too late. Look at this! The virus. The sterility. This formula. What? This is the key. We can stop it all. Yes, yes, we can stop it all. <laughs> uh, yes. Science. This formula will stop the virus. Science, bitch! <laughs> You'll want to play another ad. Remember to use the clock at the top to count you in. Remember to use the clock at the top. Right. I guess I better explain how to deal with bleeping elsewhere. 
swear words. As you probably notice, the broadcast screen here is about two seconds behind the master screen here. Yes. When someone mm -hmm. says a naughty word, the bleep button lights up like this. Two seconds later, you'll hear that swear word going out on the broadcast, and you need to hold down the bleep button or the space bar on your keyboard for as long as the swear word lasts. It can take a bit of practice getting used to hearing two things at once. Just stay calm oh. and you'll get it. And if you can't tell when to bleep, you just bleep live. Button, you'll literally be able to see the sound scrolling by. All you've got to do is hold it down while the red bit is over the red line. Oh, that, Simple. that's of course, cool. Oh, do it by eye. that's have to take your eye off way the easier than I thought it was. Real professionals do it by ear. Most people like to have the volume of the broadcast screen a little bit below the master screen. Let's set it now. As you turn it up, you'll hear the ad oh. louder. Good. You're set to start censoring. Like I was saying, it takes a little practice, but I'll try and help you through it and soon we'll have you bleeping like a pro. Remember, button lights up, count one, two, and hold it down. Steal and a deal. We got those shares. You want crazy? We got crazy. Crazy Neil's got crazy deals. Remember to select screen one now that you've got the feed. Don't wait for the broadcast to go live. That's too late. You can use the number buttons on your keyboard. One to four. Are you sure? Okay. You want it? We've got it. You pay us. Welcome back. And I'm told we can now go Welcome live back. to advance headquarters. I'm told we can now go live to advance headquarters. Ah. Headquarters. Ah. Headquarters. Ah. headquarters by the two Salisbury. leaders who are about to make their Julia acceptance Salisbury. address. Are about to make their acceptance address. Cut to the outside broadcast. Oh, oh shit. Right. 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 Get ready right. to right. 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 Uh, Thank you okay. all for coming. Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for coming. And well, ah, lovely audio we've got going here. But early, but there's no language. Shut the fuck up, bitch. <laughs> Just oh my lord. Aussies. Oh my god, this is disorienting. Yeah, um. I mean, you can turn down the second broadcast. You have that power. Yeah, we don't really need to hear that. Better, fairer future. When the party's over, they shouldn't be celebrating. They should be putting their shitting pants on and opening their dusty checkbook. Again, colorfully. They should be putting their. <laughs> I I'm so confused. This is actually Assets relatively and wealth office. act working on the tax office. So basically, you're taxing people. Good to know. You know this, or probably you, you rather you don't, because the likes of you and me are not welcome in their gated community. Tomorrow we will be introducing. Well, I wonder why you're not welcome. <laughs> Maybe because you're fucking drunk while accepting a political thing. <laughs> this is really what what Aussie politics is like. You know, <laughs> this is what I imagine the Aussies think our politics are like. <laughs> it's not that big of an exaggeration. No, the only difference is it's not alcohol; it's drugs. <laughs> you know, they're not holding a glass, they're holding a credit card when they come in. Affair. The drug is money! But you'll see when we reclaimed what's ours, that's absolute ferret shite. So for you, ferret shite. People who pay you a pittance to serve them drinks in their private clubs. Why, why ferrets explicitly? So they've got time to get even fucking richer. Advance have this to say to you. Ends today. We are coming for your sports cars and your mansions and your vineyards. It ends today. Don't do that. Oh. Put the wealth of this country back where it should have always been. It's probably easier. In the hands of the people who created it. It ends today. Yes. 
It ends today. And tomorrow, we'll start making uh, it fair again. We'll start making wait, hang on. Is the advance party just a communist party? Yes. Huh. Call me! Well, Call I suppose me! it's socialism. Yeah, go I suppose it's socialism, but... Acceptance speech there from the leaders of advance, and our apologies for the fruity language. Hopefully, we got that. Shut up, bitch! There was no dirty language. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you beeped a bit early a few times, but that's better than being late, I suppose. Yeah. National nightly news. National nightly news. With full coverage of the first day under advance. I'm Jeremy Donaldson. Have a peaceful. Right. Looks like you've got it now. Thanks for the help. Just cut him off. Yeah, fuck him. Yeah. Job's yours, mate. Good luck. I'm not back. Bitch! <laughs> Job's yours now, mate. Good luck. You should be so lucky. We need a bitch counter in the top corner. Lucky you. Try not to get murdered. You just like making things difficult for me. <laughs> Except don't, don't do that, because I don't want you to commit sewer slide. I mean, it wouldn't be that hard. It'd just be annoying. Congratulations, you got an A+. That must be a first for you. I'm sorry, that was that, that was mean. <laughs> I was pretty much a CB student. <laughs> that was mean. <laughs> and, uh, we're going to cut to here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for putting up with our fuckery. I hope you have a good night. Share this with your dog. Now go the fuck to sleep.